Hello, I'm Jory Karen, host of Is It a Good Idea to Microwave This? And I can't, for the life of me, figure out how to get all of these orange over here if I do that. Ugh. I wish there was another, you know, well-respected channel on YouTube that could teach me how to solve this. Oh wait, there is. Let's go to Dan Brown. Hey there, Jory. I think I can help. Do not try and solve the cube. That is impossible. Instead, only try to realize the truth. There is no cube. Then you'll see. It is not the cube that solves. It is only yourself. <laughs> Hope that helps. Back over to you, Jory. Thanks, Dan. So, you're saying all I have to do is just... You're right, you're right, you're completely right. I see, I see what you did there. Man, that's brilliant, isn't it? Let's go microwave it. Is it a good idea to microwave this? Let's find out. Here at the Jory Karen Laboratory, safety is our number one concern. That's why we hide behind this giant tinfoil shield. It's to protect our nuts because nobody How likes... How did you get yours done so fast? I mean, you got your all lucked out with... Don Dan Brown or something. I got my yeah. Tritimus 411. It's all about who you know. Yeah. And you don't know Dan Brown. Very good people. So, let's go inside our, our laboratory over here. We also have these fans circulate the air, and as always, the sharp carousel microwave Tracy. At the end of the day, when I solve a Rubik's Cube, I want someone who can, like, congratulate me and, you know, just know my needs. And Tracy can do all of that and more. I wonder how long you should put it in there for. Dude, Rubik's has nine sides. No, I mean, six, six sides. sides. So six minutes. <laughs> six Fail. minutes. Okay, let's Fail. go. Let's go. Six sides. Uh, nine uh, nine I, cubes. Well, I, I, was was thinking, I was thinking of the, the nine yeah. cubes on each side. Is yeah. what I meant. Yeah, okay. That's what I meant. So you can... Rock out with your cock out. Rubik's cubes away. Sure. You're going to try to solve oh, it? It just popped up. What? It seriously popped huh? up. Jory, it hopped. You're making this up. No, it hopped up. You're the one who's hopped up. I, s I seriously think it just hopped up. I don't understand what you're trying to tell me. You're saying it, it went bounced? Like that. It's a cube. It doesn't bounce. Balls bounce. Yeah, you know it's 411. You still didn't send me a good Rubik's Cube. You're still trying to solve that one, Riley? Do you know how many different combinations there are for a Rubik's yeah, Cube? I don't know. Five or twelve, maybe? No. There's, a, there's like billions. billions. So, yeah. Oh, it's smoking. Ooh, it is. Smoking's bad for your health. Oh, I don't there's know. light coming from the bottom. Oh, no dude. way, dude. It, it is. Wow, it's really smoking now. This Rubik's Cube is going to explode. Dan Brown, what the hell did you put in this Rubik's Cube? I can't even see any more in there. Neither can I. So, no, leave it on. I think it'll catch fire. And that could be awesome. You think it'll be easier to solve when it's, you know, a melted blob and you can just morph it to wherever you want? I mean, if it were me, I'd just see Oh! There's the fire! Oh, yes! Right what now. sparked it? It's... there's no... What? Masks on. Masks on. Oh, I wish I had a mask, you lucky pricks. Ready? Riley, you close the door immediately behind me. You understand? You are, yep. Do you understand? I understand. Ready? Out. Go, go, now. go. Move it, move it. The smell is a lot worse in person, people. Open that thing wide up, boy. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh my I think, get, I think that's about the point of origin right there. Oh! <laughs> I dropped a little turd! I'm definitely playing with this kind of boy. Look at so I guess it is easier to do because you now I can move the cubes wherever you want them to. Oh. Hey look at a screw. Does that hold it all together? I guess so. Oh, Careful they're hot. Oh. Okay, so oh, you may be wondering, is it a good oh. idea oh. to microwave a Rubik's it's cube? I'm saying it probably produces more enjoyment just trying to solve it. Now uh, it's way easy to solve. You just put yeah. the cubes wherever you want. You just rebuild it. And you that's, rebuild it. That's it for Is It a Good Idea to Microwave This? I'm your host, Jory Karen. And until next time, guys, stay classy. Stay classy. Don't try solving your Rubik's Cube this way. Here in Dan Brown's bedroom, safety is our number one concern. That's why I hide behind this giant gorilla mask shield. It's to protect my face, because nobody likes an ugly face.